Welcome to Music Theory Grade 3, and we are in Week 5, brought to you by To Enable. Today we are going to be looking at scales and tone degrees. For the first part, we'll be discussing major scales and minor scales. And then for the second part, we'll be learning how to write and figure scales and also the technical names. Major scales. We have learned in the previous grades how to construct a major scale. We know that a major scale consists of the following pattern of steps. Let us look at the C major. We have C major from C until a high C or an octave high C. We notice that the pattern of steps, which will be our tones and our semitones, will be situated between C and D, which will be a tone, D and E a tone, E and F, which is the third degree, and the fourth degree is a semitone, F and G a tone, G and A a tone, A and B a tone, and then between the 7th degree and the 8th degree, we have a semitone. All major scales are built on a pattern like that. Let us look at the D major scale and see if this is true. Between D and E, it's a tone. Yes. Between E and F sharp, it's a tone. Between the third degree and the fourth degree, it's a semitone. Between G and A, it's a tone. A and B, a tone. B and C sharp, a tone. And then finally, between the seventh degree and the eighth degree, will be a semitone. It will this be the same with B major or B flat major, which will have the same patterns. We'll just check for the third and fourth degree between D and E flat. Yes, it's a semitone. Between the seventh degree and the eighth degree. It will be a semitone. All major scales are built on these steps. Minor scales. As we have learned in the previous week, that all major scales have relative minor scales. They use the same key signatures Although other accidentals are introduced. Accidentals in minor scales, remember this, do not alter the key signature in any way. There are three types of minor scales, namely the natural minor scale, also known as the Aeolian scale, the harmonic minor scale, and the melodic minor scale. Let us look at the natural minor scale. It is called the natural minor scale because it is the direct relative scale to the major scale. It will be built on the sixth, which is the submedian of the major scale. For example, C major relative minor is A minor scale. 
And just like the C major, the relative A minor scale does not have any sharps or flats. This scale is the same ascending and descending from 1 until 8 and also from 8 until 1. We also have what we call the harmonic minor scale. With the harmonic minor scale, it is the natural minor scale, but with a raised or sharpened seventh. It is used for minor harmonies, for example, chords or supporting voices, vertical music. So chords or supporting voices that support the melody. This scale is the same ascending and descending. Let us look at the D harmonic minor scale. With the D harmonic minor scale, first of all we must notice what key it is in. It is the D harmonic minor scale which is relative to the F major. We know that F major has got only one flat, which is the B flat. As we said, with the harmonic minor scale, it must have a raised or sharpened seventh. So from D, one, two, three, four, five, There's the seventh. Is it raised? Yes, it is raised. Then finally, eight. So that's how the D harmonic minor scale is, is constructed. We will notice again, if we look at the second and third degrees, which is E and F, that it is a semitone. We will also notice that between the fifth degree and the sixth degree, which is A and B flat, remember it's in the key, it is a semitone. And then from 7 until 8, it is another semitone. Let us see if our theory works for other harmonic minor scales. As I said, the sharpened seventh does not affect the key in any way. Above is the E harmonic minor, which is the relative of G major. When we look at the key signature, we notice that it's got only one sharp. That's why it is relative to G major. If we count the steps, we notice that the seventh is raised. And the semitones. Between 2 and 3, it's a semitone, which is the D, or rather the F sharp and G. And then between the 5th degree, B and C, it's a semitone. And then the last semitone is between the 7th and the 8th degree which is a semitone. That is for the harmonic minor scale. Melodic minor scales. The melodic minor scale is a harmonic minor scale, but with a raised or sharpened sixth. It has got a raised sharpened or sharpened sixth 
and sharpen seventh ascending and when descending it becomes a natural minor it is used to create minor melodies for example solo singing that will be horizontal music single notes that go horizontally it has a raised sixth and seventh and they are made natural when descending in the scale let us look at the example which is a melodic minor we notice that from the first degree we have labeled it one when it's ascending to eight and when it's descending we have labeled it eight until one as we said the melodic minor scale must have a raised sixth and a raised seven. There's a raised six and a raised seven. Descending will have the raised six and seven made natural. When we say made natural, we mean that it is made natural to the scale. Now we understand that the A minor is the relative of C major, which has no sharps or flats. That's why they are not indicated in the key signature there. Therefore, when we have made the sixth and the seventh degree natural, we have made them natural to the scale. If the sixth and the seventh degrees had were in the key signatures then they would be made to that particular key signature we also notice in the the, the 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 we notice the pattern of steps let's let's indicate the semitones the semitones will be between the second degree and the third degree and also the seventh degree and the eighth degree that's the melodic minor ascending then descending will have the semitones between the fifth and the sixth degree and also the second and the third degree in the above we notice how the sixth and the seventh degrees are raised and when descending flattened remember sharps become double sharps when raised and flats become natural when raised thank you we're going to be looking at 